Hey guys, how's it going? So my friend April did the six products I want to use up by the end of summer um, tag, I guess. Not really a tag, just a thing, a video, whatever. So um, anyway, uh, I thought that was a fantastic idea and Sarah and I were talking about it and she was like, dear god, please do that first. So it helps me decide. So I picked out six items that I want to finish by the end of summer. <laughs> uh, I don't really know how to define the end of summer because I live in California. So the end of summer is like... November. So, um, I'll just do another video at some point and, like, confirm that I've in fact used these up. They are skincare, because who the heck f finishes up makeup? Probably some people do. I don't. I have way too much makeup to ever finish anything up, which is good and bad, I guess. <laughs> I always have it, but, um, you know, most of the time I feel bad because I have to throw it away before it's actually, like, done. So, maybe I should focus on makeup. Maybe next time I'll do makeup. So mine's pretty much all skincare. So let's get into it. Um, the first one is the simple cleansing water. I have about half of it left. Um, I use this stuff like every day. I use micellar water of some sort, but I have like a lot of micellar water. <laughs> I have like three bottles of Bioderma because I got it at um, IMATS and I have this and I have like two other ones because I was testing them for that video I did. So I kind of want to use them up. So, I'm just committing to get rid of, getting rid of this one. I actually think I'll get rid of this one in, like, the next month or so. Because I use my cellar water every day, like, in the morning to just, like, instead of, like, using soap to wash my face, I just, like, splash my face with water and then I use this stuff. The second thing I want to get rid of is this Body Shop Pomegranate Invigorating Toner. It looks like this. This is one of those weird things. Like, they can't actually ship this to California, so I don't know how I got it. Like, they can ship all the toners, but they can't ship this one. Like, when I go to repurchase it... They, they won't ship this one. I don't know why. Um, I don't even know how I got this then. Yeah, I must have ordered it somehow. Um, anyway, it doesn't really do anything for me. Someone like talked about it and they recommended it and stuff, and it doesn't really do anything for me. I like the seaweed one. Um, the vitamin E one, Sarah uses, and I have that. Um, that's probably also going to get used up, hopefully. Um, I don't understand how to get it on my face, because like, every time I put it on the pad, it like all sinks into the pad, and it's like this thick jelly, and then I have this like gooey pad to smear on my face. I don't know, it's weird. <laughs> I need like, uh, I think I just need to use my hands, and not a pad. Maybe that's the solution. Apparently I'm too stupid to figure this out without a camera in front of my face. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to get rid of this. I probably have about half of this left, too. Um, next we have the It's Potent um, by Benefit. It's an eye cream. I've had this around for a very long time, probably like six months. I'm almost done, people. <laughs> so I just want to get rid of this um, so that I make sure I use it all up. It is um, actually a great eye cream. It is very like hydrating. It makes You can put a lot on and make a little mask with it um, and then just wipe it off after like 10-15 minutes. Or you can just rub it in and use it as eye cream. Um, I got it when I got my brows done at the Benefit Brow Bar at Ulta. Um, my eyebrows do not deal well with waxing. Like, I will get, like, super red, like, puffy and red for, like, three days. And then it'll break out, like, on both sides. So I'll just, uh, it's, it takes, like, a week to recover from getting my eyebrows waxed. So I just, I'm not ever going to do it again. Also, it's kind of bad for your skin there, so, no. Um, threading weirds me out. Because they have that string in their mouth, and... I don't know if you guys understand capillary reaction, but that spit is going through the string and it eventually will get to where your eyebrows, I don't know, it's just, it kind of weirds me out. So I need to find some place that will pluck my eyebrows for me, like give them the right shape or whatever. Um, anyway, I, I got this when I got my eyebrows done and I need to get rid of it. Um, I like it, it's okay, it's not my holy grail. Um, I'm trying the Bobbi Brown one out also right now. Um, so, and that one seems to be doing a better job of, like, retexturing my skin. I have, like, bumpy skin right here. Um, and I have, it's, like, a little bit dark in there, but it's not, like, crazy bags or anything. So, I'm just kind of, like, trying to, I think it's, like, my skin is dehydrated there. And even though I'm using these crazy eye creams, it's not hydrating. So, um, I also have this Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Eye. My friend Erin gave me this. I like this eye cream. It is, it does a really good job. It's, um, perfectly good eye cream. It's not exceptional. <laughs> so um, I'm probably about this much left in here. So I um, need to get rid of this too. I'll just have like, I have like one million eye creams like hanging about and I just need to get rid of some of them. Um, the next is this chamomile uh, cleansing oil by The Body Shop. Um, it looks like this. I don't know if you can see that. 
Um, this stuff is great. It works great. Um, I just really like balms better than I like oils. And I, again, I did a video on oils, so I have like one bazillion oils laying around. So I just want to get rid of one of them. So I just pulled, well, I think I just squirted myself in the ear. Cleansing oil, I did. Ew. <laughs> Blooper reel. No, I'm going to leave this in the video. Um, <laughs> don't fling this around is what we've learned from this video. Um, anyway, I want to get rid of this, so I'm going to work through it. Um, I'm, I've decided that instead of using like a little bit of each of them, I should just power through one and get get the bottle gone because they're all just taking up space, space that could be used for something new. Um, then I also have this Lush Mask of Magnanimity um, from Lush. It looks like this. Um, it looks like this on the inside. It's starting to dry up. See all the crackage in there. You can like absolutely just put water in here and rehydrate this. Um, but it's been around a while, so. I need to go ahead and get this like work through. You can use these for like these are not refrigerated ones, so you can use these for like three to three months. It says on there, but you can actually use them longer than that. Um, they're just like at their freshest for the first two months, and I've had this one for like a month and a half. So I need to get on it and use this mask and get it used. I hate like not finishing stuff, and I'm the person that like cuts my package open and I have this like tiny little spatula and I'll scrape everything out. My shampoo bottles the whole night. I cut everything open. <laughs> I don't know why I've got so much stuff. It's not like I'm starving for stuff to like play with, but I feel like it should get used. You paid for it, you know, right? Um, anyway, those are my six items that I am going to get through by the end of the summer. Um, I will hopefully remember to make another video and tell you guys or just mention it in a video. I'm going to start a series called Friday Follow-Ups where like I talk about something that I've already talked about. Like, because sometimes you have stuff that you want to say that you didn't get to say because you forgot or... Um, you learn something new since you made the video, um, and so I'm going to make a series called that, and I'll either tack them onto videos, or I'll make them a bonus video, or I'll make them the standalone video for that day. I'm not going to do it every Friday, but um, it seems like sometimes you have stuff to follow up with, right? Like, it's a product, and you think of something else that you want to say, or like someone asks a question, and it's thought-provoking, and then you're like, oh yeah, I should probably tell everybody about that. Um, and they'll be like super short videos, like one or two minutes. Um, Maybe I'll do a Friday follow-up on whether or not I finish the stuff is what I'm getting at. Um, but I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Anyway, uh, what are you guys trying to finish up? Do you guys do this? Do you guys have enough product that you even care? <laughs> I have so much stuff hanging around. When you get like glossy boxes and ipsy things and also you can't help it a lot when you go online shopping. Um, <laughs> you tend to accumulate a lot of stuff and the stuff is the same stuff like how many cleansing bombs do I really need right like pick one they're all pretty much the same get some coconut oil right <laughs> um, which is actually the one I like kind of prefer uh, so at some point you have to be like enough is enough I just need to get rid of some stuff so that's what I'm doing anyway I hope you enjoyed this video leave a comment below and let me know what you guys are trying to work through um, and if you're working through it because you need more space or because you don't like it like I'm gonna work through this guy because I don't like it <laughs> Um, yeah, I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. Here's my Twitter and my Instagram. If you guys want to contact me there, I'd love to chat. Uh, comment below, subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you guys next time. Bye!